What is going on, brothers and sisters? Welcome back to Humanity here. We've got ourselves a good little place. So we're gonna, like I said, we're gonna make our home here for a little bit so I can have a little bit of storage. And I'm gonna put the pumpy away because we can't use it. Give this a quick sort, nothing to sort apparently. And in this wardrobe, I'm gonna just start putting a bunch of things away, like some, I don't know. I'm trying to think of things that would go in a wardrobe, but I have so much random stuff right now. Nine millimeters, I think what I'm using. No, I think my pistol's a 45. Yeah, it's a 45. So we'll put all our bullets away that we're carrying. We'll throw some nails away just cause we need to, we need space. Okay, these don't count as weapons, so I'll just keep them on me for now. I also wish I could like, like to move stuff around in my inventory while I'm in a screen like this. I'll put these batteries away. Cool. So that's okay for the moment. So that's just a wardrobe in here. If I grab my hammer, actually dropped it on the ground. Here we go. And I go into the build menu. So you see, we have a bunch of different things here. So like I could build us a radio. We'll need like a car battery and a bunch of cool things. Table saw, a workbench is probably like one of the first things we will want. So I'm gonna plop it down. We'll just plop it in, in the room with us here. Put it in the corner. Good enough for me. So you can see here, you... Uh, do I need the hammer in my hand? I do have the hammer in my hand. Do I need the build menu up? I need the build menu up. So with this up, I can add in the resources of nails, scrap wood, metal, etc. And I don't have those on me, obviously, but that's okay. I don't know why this sort button's here. Oh, there we go. I feel like I've clicked it a few times, but I never did anything. That time it did though, so that's good. So we've got that that we can build. Oh, gotta bring my hammer back out. Okay. Gotta bring my hammer back out. There we go. And in here, a melee bench. That's it. That's called an anvil, sir. <laughs> a melee bench, a gun bench, a furnace. Wood, sheet metal, cement, a fat, a fat converter. These are also hard to read too. So like squinting and moving my head to that side of the screen. We also have defenses so I can do like barricades. I can do metal barricades, nails, wood, and a sheet metal, small shelters, a base gate, wooden doors, barbed wire defense steak so that's pretty cool so like if i grab one of these for instance like you know i can come up and and barricade these off so that's some pretty cool stuff and then uh, lastly in the build menu some other stuff some traps farming plots fishing traps a spawn point this allows you to set a respawn point as disabled as disabled zombies spawning nearby oh I, I think it means this allows you to set a respawn point and disables zombies spawning nearby. That's actually really nice. I think it needs to be outside. So if you don't want zombies to spawn near your home, go like, hey, excuse me, this is a private property. Okay. So we can get some scrap metal. I don't think this was, oh yeah, this was something I could search, so. So there's that. Now I want to go grab some scrap metal just so I can complete that sign. Cause that's pretty neat. I think that's a pretty neat thing in the game. Got another house over here. Doors open. Excuse me coming through. Anybody here? Looks empty. Some rope. Looking at some more craftables too. What's this? An energy bar? Anything in the stove? Nope. Fridge water and some jam cupboard nothing the washing room just some more clothes keeping you warm best insulation is that what I have that's what I have okay no dirty water I would have taken it this time just to because I have a home now to put my dirty water in. I can store all my dirty water in a toilet. <laughs> all right, so that's taken care of. 
Is there another house like up here? I think so. I don't know. Maybe the map's a little inaccurate. No, I don't think there is. It wouldn't make sense because you know, it, the road ended there. This is a nice little fence. Can I break it? Doesn't seem to be the case. Oh, there was a little barn back here. Oh, it's a greenhouse. Oh, that's sexy. Oh, and a, and a shed. There's an ax in there. I'm not gonna bother grabbing that just yet. And back here, oh, that's nothing. Open the lock. Oh my God, a warrior mask might give some protection. Oh wait, it goes over this mask. Help stop the spread of the common cold. I was wearing that. Oh man, we look good. Oh, some more arrows. I definitely need those, a bottle of purifying tabs. Cool, luggage, another beanie. What's this? Oh, it's a stool. No samples in it though. <laughs> I got them. This looks like scrap. I don't know if I can break with an ax, but I'm going to. Definitely can. One other thing that's just a bit awkward. It's like you can't tell if you're breaking it or not. So I'm like, I'm like, is it working? Ooh, we found a starter in that too. So we do find potentially find materials in scrapped items. Take that. I don't think I don't have a lot of room here. I'm going to eat the old cereal. It looks like it increases food, decreases thirst, which makes sense. It's old cereal. And I can't believe I just smashed a box of dry cereal. Fucking monster. Pork and beans. I'm gonna I'm gonna I can't take it, so I'm 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 just full. Wait, th does this have a health bar? It does. Did 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 that car have a health bar and I missed it? Hold on, let's see if I can take back what I said. No, it does not have a health bar. Okay. We'll come back to these. I don't want to waste my fire ax because I do want to use this to chop down trees potentially. Grab a water, a revolver. Wait, maybe if I equip that. Can't, I can't equip it. Okay, hold on. I'll just eat this energy bar. And now I should be able to build this sign. Pull up my hammer, my build menu. Okay. All right, so I, it seems like it's set. It doesn't really change how it interacted, but shut the door because we're not animals. And I'm gonna do a little depot here. And I'm gonna put down the revolver I found in here. And we need some like storage. So what do we have for storage options, right? Oh, I didn't even realize I had this crafting menu in here because I had so many things given to me. <clears throat> so this is how we like purify things. I can make a shiv with a rag, nice. A nail bomb, improvised stone spear knife. It's just called the stone spear, it's fine. We can make rope from fibers. Fibers. We can make bait from fish. Okay. Nailed bat, barbed wire and nails with a baseball bat, improvised axe, torches. Okay, cool. So we can still make a bunch of things from scratch. A repair kit is a car battery, a screwdriver, a wrench and gears. That's a weird repair kit. <clears throat> I will say that's a bit awkward. Um, other than that, we did get an extra skill point. What can we do with two? Distance viewing with the binos. Less resources for building could be pretty huge. More damage with the blade. Bigger chance to smash a head clean off. Fair. Better damage with pistols. Better damage with bow. That's huge, honestly. I might grab a bow master. I'm I'm a pretty big bowman, you know. Increased 
stacking of items. That's fucking massive. Less stamina when running. Less stamina chopping wood. Carry more weight. Increased eating stats. Higher chance of catching food in traps. I'm going to go with... Ooh, okay, I'm still going to hold off because I don't need it. So, But I want lockpick just in case I run into a scenario where I need to you know, lockpick things. So if I come in here... Ah, storage container. I can make a weapon crate with four wood, scrap metal, and eight nails. For storing weapons only. Okay. And then a storage crate will just store all my items. I feel like I want this to face the other way. Why? Oh, there we go. I was like, man, that is super slow. Can I... What? Placing's a little weird, but I'm okay with this. Like, I'm here for it. Wait, can I just, like, throw this up in the air? I can. Okay. I'll add that, the net, the scrap metal in there that I have. I think for now, I might just need to drop things on the ground. I don't know... I don't know if I can uh, house a lot of stuff. Oh, but you know what? Let me put the the pistol away. I need the axe with me. I'll, and I need the bow in case I get attacked. Okay. And then, oh, I need my I need my saw. I have my saw on me. Okay. Let's just head outside and cut some trees to get some wood. So we chopped this tree down. Got a bunch of logs my hands are full okay so like i can take logs i also it, it, it did tell me if i right clicked i would drop things but it doesn't seem to be the case because i have to like open the inventory and drop things that could just be a me thing though how do i equip the saw can saw wood from logs can be used as a weapon here we go Oh, that was beautiful. I like that. I like that a lot. Let's chop this wood. I just need my nails. Okay, and, and it can just float. Oops. Okay, I also added some wood and scrap metal that I had and the nails to that workbench, which is fine. That is fine. And then I think in here... Give me these. Actually, the matches can stay in here. I just I just want to grab, like, crafting materials, potentially. And the batteries, I suppose, too. So let's see. The storage container, huge. Absolutely massive storage container. That's awesome. Uh, put the sheet metal in here. Every I want to try and maybe have, like, craftables in here. But obviously, for now, it's just going to be everything. But eventually, it would be craftables. The food's going to go in the kitchen. And I don't need 45. I don't need any ammo right now, so I'm just going to put all this away. And then that's a bottle of purifying tabs. Actually, let me open that. And then I don't need this mask. I don't need the saw on me right now. I should keep painkillers on me. I don't need electronics, and I don't need rope. Okay, and then I've got that. No! No! No, I used it, son of a bitch. That, that yeah, it's just it's just bad UI. I wanted to drag it to move my inventory slots around because I didn't like where they were. But the only way to do it is actually hitting sort and it's just kind of random like I can't like move things like between like manually like I have to like do them one by one with everything. It's just it's just awkward, and I don't like it. But you know what? It is what it is. I accidentally just used a fresh med kit. Let's drink some water. All right. And so for, to make our bench here, I just need a little bit more wood and some scrap metal. So we need to go break another car. And I need my saw with me. So I can grab the wood because I never finished. I couldn't pick up all the wood that was on the ground, actually. So that should be enough. Then we just need to go break a car. And I've got one right here, actually. And finish that off. Awesome. So let's see. Use the crafting bench. 
Okay, so now we just have a few extra things. Like I can make arrows. I can make fire arrows if I have a bottle of liquor. Nice. Arrows is just two wood. I can make crossbow bolts now. We can also make a wooden bow, which is... I would say probably similar to what I have. Probably not as good as what I have. A metal cleaver is pretty sick. We can now make lock picks, a screwdriver, and some metal. I wonder if it, like, uses the screwdriver. Like, do I lose the screwdriver? We can make nails. We can make nails out of scrap metal, scrap metal out of sheet metal, sheet metal out of scrap metal. Okay. We can make barbed wire gun repair kits as well oil rags and gun parts that makes sense there's the bait so it's still the same stuff that was in our pockets plus a little extra now so it looks like it's just these top parts that are extra so now we can do that okay, sorry i didn't mean to just kick the ground there my bad what else could we potentially build we could build a chemistry set wood nails scrap metal sheet metal Okay, that mattress isn't real. I'll add the resources I have on me just to clear up my inventory. I need one more scrap metal and some wood. So, but I could go to my crafting bench here and make some scrap metal real fast and then come back here and add. Oh, hold on, sorry, it's, it's in my, what's happening? Am I stuck on something? What's going on? Drop my hammer. Uh, here it is. There we go. Now I just need nails and three wood. Okay. So now we've got a chemistry bench. So now we can make treatment for infection, irradiated blood, painkillers, and a syringe. We can make med kits out of painkillers and rags. We can make painkillers out of sulfuric and nitrous acid. Okay. And then we can make gunpowder out of coal and salt powder. Neat. What other buildables do we have here that we can uh, test out and play with? A table saw helps turns logs into wood the easy way. Okay. That's only easy if there's a way for me to cart all the wood here because I can't carry more than one piece of wood on me or logs on me. A cooking stove, wooden sheet metal. Put that here next to the chem set. I've got sheet metal in the storage container. Okay, building, I leveled up as well. I need matches or a drill kit. Okay, I mean, I have matches, so. Give me those. Okay. So now I, I don't like how you have to light it to interact with it though. Like it's a waste of a match, but I could make baked potatoes. We can make boiled eggs. I think I got rid of my eggs. Can make carrot soup. Looks like we can make a bunch of different stews with empty cans, water, some meats and veggies. So that's awesome. Cooked rice, potato soup, boiled eggs, veggie soup, water. Then we can get some cooked meat, perch, pike and salmons. And we can also make a cup of coffee. Okay, that's neat. And then there's the weapon, the, sh the melee bench. I don't have any cement or refined iron. A gun bench for crafting guns and ammo is pretty neat. A table saw, we've already looked at the distiller. Craft fuel and liquor, that's pretty cool. Uh, I can't build a radio yet. Attempt to call in a trader to my location, that's pretty cool. A furnace, uh, maybe the, oh yeah, I can't make a melee bench. Refined iron and cement, that's interesting. Cement, we don't know how to get. We could build, I like how a melee bench is more materials needed than a gun bench is. Scrap metal, wooden nails. I don't think I'm gonna, yeah, well, we got some time. Why don't I go out and grab a little bit more wood? Yeah, I just need a couple pieces of wood and then I'm all set. Just chopping down trees, sawing logs, getting sticks. I do enjoy these parts of games. It's just relaxing. And for our weapon bench, oh, I need to go grab some scrap metal out of my chest. 
Not the mask. I have the scrap metal. Oh, I need scrap metal. Two scrap metal, not sheet metal. Let's make scrap metal. Thank you. Oh, two seconds. Thank you. <clears throat> I also wish it told you the quantities it was making. Because it says it's just making scrap metal here, but you do get two out of it. So adding the quantities to the UI will be huge because like... Some people might not be like, why would I get rid of a perch for a single piece of bait to then try and catch one perch, right? It doesn't make sense. Like you most likely get multiple, but you just, you don't know because the UI is a little sloppy. All right. And now we can see here for ammo, we need to get brass casings and gunpowder to make ammo casings. Actually, that's just to make the ammo. 50 cal ammo, brass casings. It's all the same, which is interesting. That's not realistic, but that's okay. I can make an AK-47 with oil, wood, four gun parts, and some refined iron. A hunting rifle, a pistol, a pumpy, an Uzi. Oh, okay. Cool. Pretty easy, honestly. You just got to figure out, you just got to find the gun parts. Like once you find the gun parts, you probably already have like plenty of iron and stuff around. The question is just, can I make a pickaxe? Like, I, I haven't seen anything that's a pickaxe, right? Like, I haven't seen an improvised pick, you know, improvised spear, a wood weapon, a nailed wood weapon, a torch, an axe, a bat. I mean, maybe we can just, why don't we just take a walk outside? I found some ore deposits or potential ore deposits. I don't know. And why don't we just smack them with our fire axe and see what happens. But brothers and sisters, other than that, I think that's a good little look into the building system, the crafting. Yeah, it doesn't seem to be reacting. I might need to make that melee bench to make a pickaxe or find one. Double check our crafting in our pocket here just to make sure I'm not missing something. I don't see anything in here. Put the hammer on. Yeah. Like that's just a standard motion. It's not doing anything special. Yeah, doesn't seem like it's doing anything here. Okay, but yeah, brothers and sisters, I think this is a good little bit of our first look into Humanit Z. Like I said, if you're liking it and you do want to see more, you gotta hit that like button. You gotta comment, you gotta be subscribed because all of those things will tell me how much more you wanna see. Or if you would rather just see maybe a little Project Zomboid run through, let me know about that down in the comments below because this kind of seems like a watered down Project Zomboid so far. Obviously, it's early access, still has a lot of polishing, needs some work on the UI, camera angles, etc. Like, I should be able to move the camera with my mouse. It's how, like, 50% of the game is played is mouse and WASAD, right? So, should absolutely be able to move the camera with this. And just some other small things as well. But all right, brothers and sisters, so I'm going to wrap this one up here. So, until next time, stay shabby.